All right, welcome to our kitchen. Today we're gonna make for you a fish and poppy uh, oak. Uh, basically what that is, is cooking fish in a parchment or in paper. You can actually cook in banana leaves, you can cook in corn husk, basically whatever it is to encase the fish and so it can steam. So today we're gonna make some comp uh, compound butter, uh, using butter, some garlic, shallots, parsley, salt, pepper, and white wine. purpose of using a compound butter is basically you get a lot of your uh, seasonings in there and uh, put it on top of the fish so as it's cold it, and it starts to steam it actually melts down and it takes longer to infuse and incorporate the flavors into your dish. So once you got it incorporated I'm going to take it to a parchment paper or you can use plastic wrap whatever you're comfortable with. Basically put it right in the center and you're going to form it into a cylinder. Wrap it up nice and tight. Spread it out. Get a nice cylinder going. Once you get to that point, put it in the refrigerator. Let it cool and harden. So your next step is getting your parchment ready or if you're going to use banana leaves or whatever, your corn husk. But what you're going to do is you're going to cut your parchment paper. You're going to fold it and cut it into kind of like a heart shape like you did when you were a kid doing craft paper. Once you get to that step, you're going to get your vegetables ready, put that in the bottom, and you're going to start with some bell peppers, some squash, we got some zucchini, we got some uh, yellow crookneck squash, some carrots, and some julienne leeks. Once you get to this point, you're going to get your fish. In this case, we're using a Pacific cod. You can use any firm white fish at this point. If you uh, find out what, you're doing, what kind of fish you want to use, you can do the uh, Monterey Bay Seafood Watch. And what that is, is basically it lets you know any fish is, that's being caught, farmed responsibly. In this case, if you didn't want to use cod, you could use halibut. And if you look on the safety watch, the halibut will actually tell you to avoid um, Atlantic wild caught cod because we've overfished and dropped the levels to where it's not sustainable. And most restaurants in the country will not use it. So once you get to this point, a little bit of salt, season it with pepper, a couple cuts of lemon. Put that right on top. Your dill and a little bit of compound butter. that right on top. At this point, you're gonna wrap your parchment. If you've done pastry, it's pretty easy to do. If you haven't done pastry, basically all you wanna do is fold it in tight. Fold, fold, fold it all the way around. Once you get to the end, you wanna fold that over and just twist. Perfect, just like that. With that, we're gonna put it in the oven. Now that it's been cooked, we're gonna plate it up. Just slide it right off onto the plate. So traditionally, it's plated with the parchment on top of it. And when you open it up, you should be able to see the steam coming out of it with a perfectly cooked piece of fish. There you go. As you have it, you have the fish on top. You have your perfectly cooked steamed veggies underneath. And it's a meal all in one pouch. Chef's Menu is brought to you by the Sustainable Food Systems Program at Rio Salado College. For today's recipe, please visit this address.